We're going to look at how to add a widget to your sidebar. So the first thing we need to do is make sure that we have some testimonials in place to begin. So let's just go to testimonials. And yeah, according to our testimonials area, we have about four or five testimonials here. Four. So um, we can use these to create a widget test, a widget instance of a testimonial. So let's go to our widget area first and add the testimonial widget. So we'll go to appearance, widgets. We see Handsome Testimonials Pro as a widget, which we can click here to add. That adds, adds this. I'm going to move it up to the top. But if I select here, I see that there's no widget instances. And yet I do have widget, you know, I do have testimonials in the testimonial area. So what, what's going on with that? So first, let's give this a name, just call this testimonial. Testimonial. And then um, what we need to do first is create a widget instance. And how do we do that? We need to simply go to either a post or a page. And just what I like to do is just create a new one. And I'm not going to save this post. It's just going to be to create the widget instance. Once I'm here, I don't have to even fill any of this out. I can just go to Insert Testimonial. I can create a testimonial or customize. Really, this is customizing the, the testimonials that we already have based on um, the criteria I want. So let's do this and display a single one. Let's choose um, this one. Let's change the color, make it maybe green, go to some advanced options, um, make it a square image. You get the idea, just creating basically my, my dis decided testimonial. And then when I'm ready and I like how this looks, I'm going to call this woman, woman one. Well, this is woman two, so I'll call it. As a one two, and I'll save. I can now retrieve this in my widgets. Um, I can also see it here. So now I can go back. I'm just going to refresh this page, and I'm just simply just going to select woman two here. Now, what do I do with the post that I created? I can actually just close this, and since I didn't save it or anything, I can just close this tab and get rid of it. I don't have to save it, I don't have to do anything like that. If it was saved by draft, I can delete it just with, to trash. And now let's go check it out on the front page. And there it is.